Good afternoon. I hope you're all well, or as well as can possibly be for the time being. Weather's a bit miserable out there today. Seems a little misty and uh, not attractive looking, not like it often does. So we're on Monday 8th of March, the children have gone back to school. I hope they're all well, safe and happy to be with one another again. That must be glorious for them. Yes, so March the 8th, I'm going to be sharing healing prayers for every day. So I'll begin with the little prayer. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Prayer to my guardian angel. Angel of God, my guardian dear, to whom his love commits me here. Ever this day be at my side to light and guard, to rule and guide. Amen. The reading is from a psalm today. Psalm 66, verse 12. The reflection. Life can be a series of joys and sorrows. In each we learn something both are for our purification. If we can keep our eyes and hearts on Jesus, we will grow in love for the Lord and become strong spiritually. This is spiritual healing. He must increase and I must decrease. The prayer, Lord, help me to know that you make all events of my life, even my sins, work to good if I can surrender all to you. Amen. That's true, it's not easy to do, but you need to focus and have more time with the Lord. Make time where you'd be wasting it on you know, applications on the internet and looking for things that are not important or for people who are not important. So I'll read a little something from Psalm 5. Those who have received the word of God, which dwells within, will live forever. To my words give ear, O Lord. Give heed to my groaning. Attend to the sound of my cries my King and my God. It is you whom I invoke, O Lord. In the morning you hear me. In the morning I offer you my prayer, watching and waiting. You are no God who loves evil. No sinner is your guest. The boastful shall not stand their ground before your face. You hate all who do evil. You destroy all who lie. Deceitful and bloodthirsty people are hateful to you, Lord, but I, through the greatness of your love, have access to your house. I bow down before your temple filled with awe. Lead me, Lord, in your justice, because of those who lie in wait. Make clear your way before me. No truth can be found in their mouths. 
Their heart is all mischief. Their throat a wide open grave. All honey their speech. All those you protect shall be glad and ring out their joy. You shelter them. In you they rejoice. Those who love your name, Lord, it is you who bless the upright. You surround them with favour as with a shield. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Thank you for listening. May God bless you and heal you if you need it. And I'm sending you God's peace in abundance. And be happy and joyful in the Lord always. Until next time, God bless you.